This is the broadcast site of WPLG, where on December 4th, 2023 at 10 a.m., Berkshire Hathaway's only TV station will transition to ATSE 3.0. Berkshire Hathaway is putting their eggs, or should I say egg, in the ATSE 3.0 basket. All channels on WPLG are going to be displaced over to WSVN in order to make room for the ATSE 3.0 lighthouse. Now, with the addition of everything from WPLG's ATSE 1.0 signal, there will be seven channels on WSVN. Two channels will be HD, and five channels will be SD. The situation is the epitome of what I was discussing in my video called ATSE 3.0 is making ATSE 1.0 worse. After this transition, the bitrate of the ATSE 1.0 channels from WSVN and WPLG will nearly be cut in half. Unless they use AVC instead of MPEG-2, the quality of the channels will be cut in half as well. Now this ATSE 3.0 lighthouse is going to be unique because WSVN Fox and WSVN subchannels are going to be a part of the lighthouse, but only WPLG ABC is going to be a part of the lighthouse, and WPLG subchannels are not going to be a part of the lighthouse, which is interesting given that it's actually WPLG signal to begin with, I thought that was interesting. I'm hoping that they will implement the station with a robust modulation and code rate. I could really use a robust signal in my apartment, and I bet many others in South Florida would benefit as well. If you like this video, consider subscribing and liking the video. Follow Western New York Over the Air on Instagram, Twitter, and threads at WNY Over the Air. Like Western New York Over the Air on Facebook at facebook.com forward slash WNY Over the Air. Support the channel on Patreon at patreon.com forward slash WNY Over the Air. And check out WNYOverTheAir.com for live band scans, cord cutting tips, and much more.